It's Gordon. Yep. All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. Ba'ashem. Yahweh Shai. Ba'ashem. Rakakudash. Double honor to Apostle Elders of Great Millstone. And peace and salutations to you, Sasakim, pushing his words, sincerity, truth, and charity. Lord willing, this be a quick lesson on um, pretty much the titles um, The Flesh Hates, hates Adversity. adversity yeah, The Flesh Hates Adversity, man. You know, the flesh, you know, it's uncomfortable for the flesh to, to follow what's right. Follow the ways of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah, man. Yep. You know. So I was going to say, especially in a society that pushes, you know, uh, do as thou will. Mm -hmm. And basically that's, um, that, that whole spirit comes into pleasing your flesh. Yeah. You know, whatever feels good to you, even if it's the wrong thing, do it. Yeah. You know. God, God. And that's because Esau eat him. You know, uh, he he's a, a a carnal man, a beastly man. He does anything that makes him feel good. Even he doesn't care about the repercussions. God. All right. So, in this society, it's very hard, you know, to do what's right. God. That's yeah. why the Lord's got to write the law, statute, commandments. Now, in what parts, man? Because the kingdom of heaven, it'd be easy to do what's right again, man. It ain't gonna be in this chains of darkness, this corrupt flesh anymore, man. You know. God, I think I'm gonna start with the. Galatians 5 and, um, I'll start at 16. Galatians 5 and 16, it says, This I say then, walk in the Spirit, and ye shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. Mm -hmm. And that's what we got to do. Okay, we got to walk in the Spirit. If we, you know, you know, stay focused, we meditate on, you know, the Scriptures, we apply the Scriptures, we read, okay? And we're constantly staying focused, okay? It's going to be, um, it's basically going to be harder for us to uh, please the flesh, man, Okay? And we want to, you know, please the Spirit because it says, I'm going to jump real quick to Romans um, 8, and I believe it's 6. Mm -hmm. It says here in Romans 8 and 6 that uh, for to be carnally minded is death, but to yep. be spiritually minded is life and peace. And that's, you know, what we want. We want to uh, have that, you know, to be spiritually minded because that's, that's what's life and that's what's peace. All right. You know, uh, following the law, statutes and commandments, that's life because that's a, that's a real lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Everything else that's, you know, outside of the law, statutes, and commandment is really a death style. God, God. And then we warn, man. This is a war, man. Yep. The, fl the flesh, you just read it. The it, flesh, no. pretty much the flesh versus the spirit, man. Yep. It's just going to say it in the next verse. God. Verse 17. For the flesh lusteth against the spirit, and the spirit against the flesh. And these are contrary the one to another, mm -hmm. so that ye cannot do the things that ye would. Mm-hmm. God, it's hard, man. Being being his flesh, doing the right, trying to do the right thing, that's that's a difficult um, task, man. You know, it's real difficult, man. You know, it's a, it's a battle, man. And that, that makes the flesh uncomfortable, you know, when you follow in the spirit, man. You yeah, know? hey, cause you get those urges, man. Mm -hmm. You get those urges to, to do wickedness, God. and that's because as the you know the elder brother said, you know, and as the scriptures say, first and foremost, that you know we're in um these uh, chains of darkness. It's inherently given the wickedness, man. Mm -hmm. You know, kind. Of. Most I set up that way, man. See who gonna fight, man. Who gonna fight to uh, 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 follow his ways, man? Yeah. You know. I got that in Romans the um three. I mean seven. Yep, Romans seven and um. I started um. Eight, uh, should I start at fourteen to fifteen? Yeah, you can start 14. This is um, Romans 7 and 14. It says, For we know that the law is spiritual, but I am carnal, sold under sin. Mm. Okay? And, and, and um, you know, because we're in this flesh, hey, well, we're, you know, subject to sin. Mm -hmm. You know? We're not perfect yet. That's why it's going to be such a beautiful thing in the kingdom. You know, the Lord is going to, um, you know... Give us new bodies, yep. Which you know, which we're gonna need the new bodies because we're gonna get the laws put in us. Yep. Because the, the, this, this, uh, um, as the scripture said, I think it's in Corinthians that this, um, f basically, a uh, flesh can't inherit in corruption. I'm roughly paraphrasing it. Can okay. I believe it's 15. Would you quote me? Yep. You know. So the the Lord's gotta give. You know, He has to give us these new bodies because th this body can't. It, it can't uh, inherit these, you know, uh, uh, um, the, 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 you know, the incorruptible. 
It's too much for this body. Uh, and then the most side, you know, you know, we gonna be just. We got no. Hey man, we getting experience now, man, to be them uh, righteous judges in the kingdom of heaven, man. So, including too, we gotta know what it's like to be in, be in this damn flesh, man. That's right. So that's why the most side set up. We had to go through all this, man, for the kingdom, or to, for the kingdom of heaven to um, um, be be established, man. You know, we had to go through all the you know, slavery, all you know, we learn the left hand side, man. It had a three hundred sixty degrees. A knowledge, wisdom, understanding, man. Yep. You know. Verse 15, it says, and back in Romans 7 and 15, For that which I do, I allow not. For what I would, that do I not. But yeah, what you, I you, hate. You, you want to do it right, but it's hard to do in this fucking flesh, man. And then you, yeah. you, you still, you fall short sometimes, man. Yep. And it says, that do, it says, for what I would, that do I not. But what I hate, that do I. Right. God. So it's easy to go off and be and commit sins in this wicked, corrupt flesh. That's easy. But in the kingdom of heaven, it's gonna be you it's gonna be impossible for us to go off and sin, man. It's gonna be easy to keep the keep the law, statute, commandments of Yahweh by Shim Yahweh shot, man. Yeah, it's That's, gonna it's gonna be first nature. Yeah, first nature, yep. It's just gonna be like as the scriptures say, written in us. Mm -hmm. We're not gonna think twice about it. It's just we're gonna know righteousness, we're gonna know perfection. Mm-hmm. And, you know, hey, that's it's just a beautiful thing that the Lord is going to give this to us. Con, con. Beautiful to follow ways of Yahweh by Shimei Al-Shai. Like I said, we had to get the experience, you know, what it's like to be in this flesh. Because other heathen nations, uh, Esau and other heathen nations, you know, in kingdom heaven, get stabbed. They're going to still be in the flesh, man. So we been in the flesh already. We're going to be judging them, man. That's right. All right. It says in 16, if then I do that which I would not, I could send unto the law. That it is good. Now then, it is no more I that do it, but sin that dwelleth in me. Mm -hmm. It says, For I know that in me, that is in my flesh, dwelleth no good thing. Yep. For to will is present with me. But how to perform that which is good, I find not. Okay, so basically, this flesh, it's going to make you go off. This flesh is no, no good, good thing dwelleth in this flesh, man. Mm -hmm. You know, this yeah. flesh is going to make you do some uh, some strange things at times Kinda. where you might look back at it. You'd be like, well, I did that. And that's because the flesh, you know, uh, is, is basically ruling over you right now. Yeah. You know, because, hey, this is the chains of darkness, as you know, we've stated, man. There's the scripture state. Kind shit. Be Shabbat for Shabbat kick in be like, man, man, I'll keep this perfect. I'm studying, do all this. And then when Shabbat come in, you that haven't. Sexual thoughts about women, all that crazy you, stuff. You might man. actually have sex on it. Yeah, actually, right, exactly. You, you might, you, you at the beginning of the day, you, you remember it's the Shabbat, and then later in the day, it just slips your mind, and then you, you had, you, you know, you have sex, you know, you, 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 you know, uh, uh, at nighttime, all of a sudden, you're like, wait a minute, I just had sex on the Shabbat. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm speaking through, ex you know, ex experience. I, that's happened to me. Well, I didn't know. even want to do it, and then it, it was it, later. You know what I mean? In the day. Where it came to my thought, I was like, "Damn, man, I I forgot it was a Shabbat." Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's a slip slip your mind too. It's Shabbat spot, man. It'll do. Yeah, you might uh, exercise or like yeah. something like like. Damn, I forgot to fuck the Shabbat. I ain't supposed to be like this. See, you know, and it's because the it's, flesh is weak. Yeah, God. That's what it even says it uh, real quick. Can you hold up? Yeah, I got. Watch out, yeah, for that button right there. I'm gonna get it in Matthews because the even the Lord said this in um, Matthew the 26th chapter. It says Matthew 26 and 41. It says, "Watch and pray that ye enter not into temptation. The spirit indeed is willing. Okay, the spirit within us it wants to do righteousness, but what does it say here? But the flesh is weak. Yeah, but it's, it'd be hard for you to do, man. Sometimes you you fall short. Yeah, you know. That's why uh, you know Yahweh Shai dying for our sins was so important. Because he, he, he basically, you know, washed away our transgressions, okay, our sins. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it basically, it's covering us, mm -hmm. you know, and we need that covering. Ah. Because, hey, we, we've all, as the scripture said, we've all uh, fallen short of the glory of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Yeah. You know, we, we, we've all done things where we should be put to death, man. Yeah. God. Yeah. That was on that. Um, I got a little bit more in uh, Romans. Um. Uh, seven and uh, nineteen, for that, for it's like it says, for the good that I would, I do not, 
but the evil which I would not, that I do. Now, if I do that, I would not, it is no more I that do it, but the sin that dwelleth in me. Okay? So, you know, basically it's just, you know, uh, it's just repeating itself. It's just basically saying that, you know, you know, this flesh is weak. All right? You're going to go off. You try to do what's right. You don't do it. The things that are wicked, you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and that's because, you know, hey, we're in the chains of darkness. And that's why we, hey, we need to, the, that's why we need Yahweh Shai to save us from, it's not only just this captivity with Esau. It's literally our spirit is trapped in captivity in this body. Yeah. Con, con. Yeah, man. Like you said, man, we, this chains of darkness, we go off, then you be feeling bad, you beat yourself, you beat yourself over the head sometimes, like, damn, man. Yeah. You know? Like, fuck, man. You, you, you get mad, like, like, damn. You be angry, man. But it's hey, vexing. it's vexation, man. But beautiful thing is, like we said, you know, most sides getting ready to deliver us out of chains of darkness. And we're going to um, keep his ways perfect, man. Right. You know, in the kingdom of heaven, man. I had two. You had any more scriptures? No, that was it uh, from what I had. Kind. So it says, um, re just read this one. Uh, first, Colossians 3 and 5. Mortify, therefore, your members, which mm. are part of earth. Mortify the kill, man. All right. Kill this 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 uh, wicked flesh, man. You know, and, um, uh, um, being, be, being the spirit, you know, uh, don't um, do what's pleasing to the flesh, man. To the best of your ability, you know, which that's all you can do anyway, you know. But it says, uh, which are upon the earth, fornication, uncleanness, inordinate affection, evil compuses, and covetousness, which is idolatry, man. That's all of the flesh, man. Them things, that, you know, just read. Oh. For which things, for for which things sake the wrath of Yahweh cometh upon, cometh on the children of disobedience, man, you know. Yeah, because um, those are people who, who love to follow the flesh, you know, follow their fleshy desires, man. And don't give a damn about following the ways you have about Shimmy out shy. Don't even try to the best of their ability. And most likely going to destroy them, man. Yeah. All right. They got to look forward to destruction right along with the heathen because they heathens too, actually, man. All right. Two thirds of our own people, man. Following the, the ways of your flesh. That's you know, you you're a damn animal, man. Because we all know an animal goes off in instinct, and that's what you know. People that follow their flesh are like they go off instinct, you know. Yeah. Well, the flesh desires to do, they go along and do it, man. They don't give a damn if it's wicked. It's just good for the. It's good. It's pleasing to the flesh, and they uh, they go along with it. They don't fight the flesh, man. You know, which only the elect they 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 do that, man. They more fight their members. They fight the flesh, man, to the best of their ability, man. Yep. You know, sometimes you do fall short, man. You know, you still fuck up, man. You, you, it's going to be that way till the Lord delivers us out of his chains of darkness. That's right. All right. Uh, let me see. In, into which ye also walked some time when ye lived in them. So, yeah, we all followed the f flesh at one point in time, you know, till the Most High woke us up, you know. Now we know what's right, really right from wrong, you know. And we don't, um, we more five members as, as I started, uh, first read, you know, or, you know, we, um, you know, we, um, don't do anything to please to the flesh no more, man. Like as we did, you know, before we found out, um, the truth, man. All right. Well, it's like, I'm in off with this. This, uh, Hebrews 8 and 8 for finding, uh, fault. And with them, he said, Behold, the days come, said the Lord, where I'll make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah, which and that's the northern and southern kingdom. All right. Which consists of you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Wait a minute, they don't say Esau? No, they don't say Esau at all. How about Moab? Not 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 at all. Maybe Ammon? Nope. Because most are not <laughs> dealing with them, man. Exactly. He's only dealing with the nation of Israel, man. You know these uh, Christians talk about the new covenant; it's for everybody. No, it ain't right. It's only for the. <laughs> it ain't for y'all, man. Blatantly says right there, the, you know, uh, you know. Yeah, the, the northern, the, the kingdom of Judah and the kingdom of Israel. Con, which are straight, all Israelites. Yep. Yeah. Tell you straight, yeah, that's straight to the point, right there, man. It ain't mentioned nobody else but them, them people, the Israelites, man. It says, now according to the covenant which I made with their fathers in the day when I took them by the hand 
to lead them out of the land of Egypt because they continue not in my covenant and I regarded them not, said the Lord. They continue, yeah, they broke the covenant, man. They went we went off pretty much. And this is why we in the situation we're in right now, man. We disobeyed the ways you out by Shimei out shot. This is punishment, man. You know, being under this damn devil, man. Rulership, man. All right. Yeah. Um, it says, uh, verse 10, for this is the covenant that I will make with the house of Israel after those days, said the Lord. I will put my laws into their mind and write them in their hearts. The same thing, your heart is your mind. And I will write, I will be to them a power and they should be to me a people. All right. So most I going to write the laws in our inward parts and we're not going to go off anymore, man. Once he delivers out of his wicked captivity, man, we're currently in, man. Esau's the end of the world. Jacob is beginning to follow. Mm -hmm. That's the kingdom of heaven, man. All right. We near it at Esau Enum's end, man. All right. So it says, uh, and they should not teach every man his neighbor and every man his brother, saying, Know the Lord. For all shall know me. For all Israel, man. You, you know, two thirds of our people, they got the. Um, most I gonna destroy them right along with Esau and the other heathen nations. Cause like I said, they're heathens too right now. But when they come back through the elect, man, the law's gonna be in them as well, man. Mm -hmm. All right. So it says, know the Lord. It says we should not teach every man his. Hey, how you gonna teach somebody they already know? Mm -hmm. All right. So it says, and every man his brother saying, know the Lord, for all that shall know me, and from the least to the greatest. So all Israel's gonna know the Lord. And um, keep his ways. It ain't gonna be a, a hard. It ain't gonna be, not gonna be difficult anymore to follow what's right, man. You know, like it is now because we in this wicked, corrupt flesh, man. You know, that was it on that. That's pretty much it. Con, con. So um, with that, you know, like you know, hey man, the Lord, hey man, it's right around the corner. Lord, getting ready to get us out of these chains of darkness, man. The beautiful thing is, we're gonna actually. Follow the ways of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh shot perfect, man. You know, and not go off no more, man. So with that, I'd like to give all praise, honor, glory to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh shot by Shem Kabbadash. The bonds of Apostle Elders, great millstone, peace and salutations to you, Sasaki, and pushing this word and sincerity, truth and charity. With that, say Shalom. Shalom.